All right, guys, let's talk about some lunging. We're gonna talk about a reverse lunge. Uh, with the reverse lunge, ideally, uh, we are taking a step back that is gonna allow the trailing leg to tap the ground. Tap the ground gently, okay? We wanna control the movement. We wanna try to avoid supporting ourselves with our arms. We wanna work on creating the strength from the midline and the trunk to support ourselves, um, support our own body weight, okay? So, uh, from a standing neutral position, from there, I am simply gonna take a step back, okay? The trailing leg is gonna tap the ground, and I'll step back up, and we'll alternate and switch legs. Now, one of the things we wanna watch for when we're doing this, is with any other movement, uh, we don't want this, whatever the supporting front leg is, to cave. We want to keep some external rotation, just enough to keep it in line and keep active, okay? So when I step back, I want to avoid this, okay? I want to try to be here. We're going to tap, stay tall, and stand, okay? So again, we're going to engage Get active and ready. Try to prevent excessive lean one way or the other. We wanna control the movement, keep the full foot on the floor, engage the glutes, create a little external rotation. Step tap, stand. Step tap, stand. If we can't reach full range, that's fine. Go with whatever range of motion allows us good movement pattern and fight for a little more range each time we do it.